Imagine if you could turn your CoLab notebook into an interactive slideshow for presentations. Unfortunately, Google CoLab doesn't offer such a tool, but we can make use of the classic Jupyter notebook. I explain how to install and run um, classic Jupyter notebook inside the CoLab environment. And to turn a Jupyter notebook into a slideshow for presentation, I'm going to show you two ways. The first way is to use RISE. So RISE is a Jupyter notebook extension that you can turn your Jupyter notebook into slideshow presentation. So what we're going to do is I'm going to install RISE. Here I'm going to install Bokeh just as an example that we will have some interactive graphic inside our Jupyter Notebook slideshow. I'm also installing Jupyter Contrib extension. So this will install the extensions into our classic Jupyter Notebook. And we will be also be able to install different extensions, enable, disable, and configure. So this is what I'm doing in this first cell here. So here at the RISE documentation, you will find how to install, how to use, you can configure, and you, can, you can have a very powerful uh, presentation notebook. So unfortunately, it's not a CoLab notebook, it's a Jupyter notebook. So we will have to do all these procedures using NGROC, HTTP tunneling, so we will have our Jupyter Notebook running inside our CoLab environment and will access into a, an external public URL and there there will be these um, tools for presentation. So let's install RISE, Boca and the Jupyter extensions. Now I will also install PyNGROC. Here is the same procedure of importing ngrok then here you put your ngrok authorization token that you get from this dashboard ngrok when you have an ngrok account next we will start our jupyter notebook at port 14000 run it in the background now we can connect our ngrok to port 14000 here we will have our URL and it's doing this HTTP tunneling so we can access the classic Jupyter notebook that is running inside Google CoLab environment. So here we have our uh, Jupyter notebook 3 and we can see that there's this new menu of the NB extensions and here we have the rise extension so you can have different parameters you can set up you can set up themes you can set up back images uh, header footer you can define shortcuts you can change the transition types we also will enable scrolling you can set up many different things you also have examples here that you can use binder not only in Google Colab, we have all these uh, features here and here you can check all the other Jupyter extensions that you can have. There are some very interesting and powerful extensions. But now let's start um, Python 3 Jupyter Notebook. So we have loaded a new Jupyter Notebook and the way we're going to use the slideshow is here we see that there is this enter or exit rise slideshow and here we have the cell to bar slideshow so now we have a slide type here so let's make a slide and this will be a markdown cell let's put the header our slide show here we are going to have some uh, print hello slideshow Now I want a subslide 
and in this and in this subslide we will have a simple uh, bokeh plotting we have here our bokeh and we have all this interactivity here and now when we will turn into a slideshow we have our slideshow we can change here it's really cool and it's interactive so you can run the cells here is our sub slide and we have here our bokeh plot with interactivity so let's zoom okay go back we can change for example the width and the height of the plot it's completely interactive you can go back here you also have the shortcuts how to go to the next slide how to go back how to have an overview of slides how to make this disappear we have here our overview and we can exit our slide show so this is a very interesting very convenient way of transforming your notebooks into a slideshow presentation we are inside google colab if you want to show results from gpus it's possible you can have interactivity with your google drive and now i'm going to show another more sophisticated approach that it's based on a rise review but they offer a bit more configuration tools easier way to configure not only by setting up rise with commands and uh, configuration files but with some interactivity on how to choose themes and types of slides so the next tool to transform a notebook into a slide is the nb present so the nb present is also an extension and you can install here using pip or using conda and there will be these menus and now in icons here so you can configure your slide what we are going to do is to install and be present and install this um, enable this extension so let's run this cell so everything seems to be properly configured so now let's start our Jupyter notebook again tunnel with ngrok now we here we have here the nb present in our nb extension we can also check here will be you can just enable disable so now here we are opening the same example we used before but now we have these two buttons here edit presentation and show presentation so for example we also use here this cell to bar and slideshow and we set a slide now we go to edit presentation so for example you can change here certain things so let's make this uh, a bit here and this is linked to uh, the output so we should have this part here hello slideshow is really uh, let's put really cool then we have the second slideshow we can also change and choose a theme so let's uh, choose this theme here okay we define theme have some slides so let's stop editing and now show presentation so here we have our slideshow and here is just showing the output hello slideshow is really cool and here we have our bokeh it doesn't look so good in this theme so we can add the presentation let's choose a different theme let's take this uh, first one for example let's remove these ones let's use this okay no more themes let's change here now we will link this 
with uh, doors. Let's see what happens. So stop now show presentation now we have our slideshow is a different style here we have print hello slideshow is really cool so it's not displaying the output and here we also have our plot with code here and you can play around so you have these two possibilities you still can have your review slideshow or you can use the NB present how you prefer. So this way you can turn your notebook into a slideshow, interactive slideshow. You can type and change your code when you are running. So let's include one more uh, circle here, one more circle here. And we have now different plots we can change here let's make smaller and we have it smaller go back here and you stop your presentation and that's it for today turning your notebooks into a slideshow for presentation inside google colab environment